the something day of Veda, and I have a giant macaroni noodle. Yes! Hello! So, how have you been? Oh, that's good. That's cool. Yeah. I am finally starting to feel like a human being again. Voice isn't quite there yet, but I'm recovering from the Quidditch World Cup. Hope you enjoyed the footage of it that I put up yesterday. If you haven't seen it yet, here it is. Quite lovely. Very, very wonderful. Great editing. Whoever does that editing. Real good job. Fantastic work. So I thought today I'd just talk a little bit about what I've been up to recently, what I've got going on this month. First of all, I got my new driver's license in the mail. What's up? New York driver's licenses are so cool. Look at this. This right here is see-through. It's like a see-through watermark of my face. It's my face backwards on my finger. Look, it's my face on my eye. We got like my signature is like raised up right there, so it feels cool. Also, I totally lied on my driver's license. Said I was 5'4". I am not 5'4", but my birthday is 5'4", so I really wanted it to be able to say height 5'4", birthday 5'4", 5'4", 5'4", 5'4", yeah. Very pleased with myself. After living in New York for four years, I finally got a New York license. I had to turn in my Texas one because it was going to expire on my birthday. No more discounts on barbecue. So I am officially a New Yorker now. Ooh, that feels weird. And I'm registered to vote here, which is pretty sick. Except that I did actually want to vote for Wendy Davis for governor in Texas. Uh, and I am an organ donor now, so any of you can have my organs, so long as you have the proper paperwork. That's how it works, as I understand. Any zombies want my brains, uh, they get first pick, because I've got it on my license. Just so long as they've got all their paperwork, they can have my brains, and we're all good. We're very pro-zombie here at Lauren the Bird Industries. Hmm, other things that are happening in my life. Oh, I went to my friend's birthday last night. Happy birthday! To my awesome friends. It's from me and Lauren. Thank you guys. Oh, that's cool. Are these like bowls? Like, yeah, this is like an actually really thoughtful present. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Marcia. Happy birthday, Marcia. Happy birthday, Marcia. Happy birthday, Marcia. Umbrero thief. <laughs> hey, we went there the first time we met. Yeah, <laughs> we went there. That's where we went. Right before we saw, not yeah. David Williams, David, David Levithan. Yeah. <laughs> same thing. Both writers, they're both a bit camp. They have the same complexion. Waffles and dinges up here. They're here. Away. It's not quite driving away yet. Away. We definitely are too late for waffles. An emergency. <laughs> Everything's happening right now. Emergency. It's like it's New York City or something. Why is so much happening? Where's the Empire State Building? I don't want to see it yet. Is there, are we, we can't see it yet. I'll show you in a minute. Empire State Building, yay! Cupcake exchange cupcake? before we leave. Cupcake for the ride. Can I steal this one? Go what? for it. Yes! Whatever you want. Do you mind if I take the double? Just have to relax out. Penny boarding. Go. I want a penny board. I need, I need another hand for my cupcake to get my metro card out. So good night everyone, say good night to you two. Yay. Good night you two. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Other things going on. Besides VEDA, I'm mostly just working. The HPA is doing Accio Books right now, which is our annual book drive. That goes until the end of May. And we're starting to prepare a lot for the summer, figuring out everything that we're going to be doing at LeakyCon and VidCon and QuidCon and ALACon and... Where else am I going this summer? Oh, I am speaking at San Diego Comic-Con again if, if the Harry Potter panel is approved, which it usually is, or has been every single year for like eight years. I'm probably going to the Midwest Media Expo, which is actually this month, that's in like two weeks from now. This is actually the first year that that con is ever happening, but it's run by the same people who did Yomacon, so should be pretty good. So if you're going to that, I might be there, probably running a kind of apparating library-ish thing. Yeah, I guess my life right now is just lots of planning trips and campaigns for work. I am also enjoying the warm weather that's starting up, starting to go running outside instead of just at the gym, so that's super fun. Hopefully I can get enough sunlight for my hair to go blonde again, because it's getting really Really dark. Someone in a YouTube comment called it brown. I don't have brown hair. I've always had blonde hair. Except for when it's been purple. Let's see. I've got a few shows that I'm going to this month and next month. I'm gonna go see Mowgli. Might see some of my friends' bands. Got tickets to see Eddie Izzard again in May. And hopefully a couple of Broadway shows like If Then and Cabaret 
and Hedwig and the Angry Inch. And Record Store Day is coming up this month too. Hopefully I can save up some money to be able to do that. And yeah, I've got a lot of Will It Waffle stuff on my plate as well. Yeah, I've got a lot going on. A lot that I, I need to be doing, as always. But everything's fun. I think that's about it that's going on. Let me know in the comments what, what you've got going on this month. What is your favorite thing that you are going to be doing this month. Oh, and tomorrow is National Grilled Cheese Day, so make sure you prepare to celebrate that if you need to go buy some groceries. National Grilled Cheese Day, happening tomorrow. Maybe you can make a grilled mac and cheese. You know, just, just a suggestion. I'll see you tomorrow.